at home. You speak of quick starts and having success at home. They've, they've scored over 40 points a game here at home. And they're looking to get started here tonight. Virginia's won the toss. They've elected to defer, so we will see that Louisville offense first. Tony Elliott, second season, leading the Virginia Cavaliers. Louisville hopes to continue living their dream in the first year under Jeff Brom. Isaac Garendo takes the kick past the 15 to the 20, just shy of the 25-yard line. But he went through warm-ups. We expect to see him at some point. First down. They want to lean heavily on the successful running game. And that's Jawar Jordan, their star running back. Early third down. Plummer across the middle. Complete. And it looks like gain of four just shy of the first down. And I look. I, I don't think there's a. No, with Jeff Brom as, as an old school coach. People might not look at it. There's some people in the stands say, hey. 1,044, reception 79. Calandria, boot, pressured, sacked. How about that for an impact player coming up? Ashton Gelati. Still Jordan in the backfield. Heavy formation. Jordan up the left side. Jordan has space. There goes Jawar Jordan. But a flag on the play the second he made his cut and a gain of 42. Assumed it was on one of them. It wasn't. It was on the defense. Call stands for Jordan, 42-yard gain. This kid's special when he's healthy. Yeah, he is. But you see the speed and the burst he has once he gets out on the outside, in the perimeter, make explosive. Play fake, easy, touchdown. So each time Louisville's had the answer to a challenge this season, they know what's at stake. They were not lying to us when they said this is a confident and swaggerful young man. Second and six, gonna need that movement there to get away from Louisville's defense and can't. Almost got back to the line of scrimmage. Garendo coming off a career high, 146 yards a week ago against Virginia Tech. He remained in the backfield. Play fake plumber. Looks downfield, checked it back down to the short receiver, and that ended up being a big gain as Dwayne Martin back off the pressure. Plumber. Middle of the field. That's caught. That's a first down. Jimmy Callaway. And we saw that. They dropped into a cover three look here. And really nice job. Jack Plummer keeping his eyes down the middle of the field. Throws a little curl flat out there. See the wide out. Widen him up. Faking he's going out to the corner. Sitting down. Callaway sits down on the curl route. That's one thing. Plum Bobbled snap. It doesn't even get off. Louisville now in a world of hurt as Brady Hodges is trying to do something, and that something ends up being nothing. Plays and getting back in this game. They need some things to happen for him right here. You just see the bobbled snap, finish the play, get him on the ground. Let's get the offense on the back and make some. Pressure comes. Calandria is yet to throw an incomplete pass. What a grab by Malik Washington. And if you look at this, the third down play at man-to-man, -man, they blitzed him. Calandria knew he had man-to-man. -man. What do you do when you have man-to-man? -man? You're a young quarterback. Hey, go out and find the, the leading receiver. In that is a prime example of it. Now first and five. Reverse. Nowhere. J.R. Wilson on the end around, and Antonio oh, no, Watts was waiting on it. And he fumbled it. Yeah, and coming off the big play right there. They're trying to go for a little trick play running. They're going to run a reverse pass here. But you see the pressure off the edge, getting up the field to seize it. Makes the tackle, ball comes out, and when you run to the football, good things happen to you to finish plays. I mean, real time, it was difficult it to see that ball pop out. And this defense continues to not allow teams to score. Seven different receivers have caught a ball tonight. Plummer scans, pressure, brought down. 
And I'll tell you what, every time Virginia looks as if they're going to give something up. Gets, gets him and forces the punt. Davies is going to let that go over his head. Just, and that, oh. Oh. Putting it on the pin right there, man. How <laughs> do you do? <laughs> you know, when you're a team, that is going to be a special teams team. Run the football, play defense. At his own 50, Daniel Sparks. And his end zone is blocked. Touchdown, Louisville. Urge to come after it right now. This is why you play defense, pin people deep, and big special teams play. Jimmy Callaway, the wide receiver. See right there, getting sneak, coming off, fighting through the block to get in there. It was actually D'Angelo Hutchinson gets the hand on it. Watch, just reach the hand out there, right to the block spot, we call it. As you go practice that, that play right there, the block spot as you go to practice on all pump block drills. Is Nine of ten. 97 yards. Can they get points to start? A two for one. Here comes Calandria. Worth noting, Virginia starts with the ball in the second half, so this would be big. Etridge had his career long field goal of 47 against Louisville. This from 42. Snap clean. Kick on the way. No good. Give you a lot of different looks in the secondary. Second and 10. To give up the middle and a flag on the play. They have man-to-man -man coverage. Hollins in the backfield. Calandria across the middle. Was that intercepted? It was. Free safety coming down to help in man-free coverage and stealing the ball away. Look at, him, look at him reading the quarterback. They're in the ACC championship game against Florida State. And right now, the formula is pretty simple for Louisville. It's Plummer, quick shot outside, and a first down, and a move. Jaden Thompson. And, there, and Tony Allen has a young football team that he's trying to build the program on. While Plummer takes a shot over the middle of the field, that's going to be a first down and more. Holman for 17. Is look, there's a little well RPO right there, and Coleman runs the slant, gets inside the back. They don't anymore. This is this is kind of a foreign offense now. And it's a play fake. It's Plummer. Oh, it shouldn't be foreign because that was a good ball play drawn up, but it was just dropped. Travel stead, no good. Pace remains in the backfield. Calandria designed run, and every time Calandria's had a run, he breaks one. Gain of 22. And inches away right there from breaking that to the end zone. Fields in motion. Calandria looks left. Comes back to his right. Makes a man miss. There goes Calandria. I'll tell you what, we talked about the Johnny Manziel comparison as he goes flipping into the stands. Fourth and goal. They're going to hand it off to the outside. Virginia gets in. Jack Greasy. And the Virginia Cavaliers finally finished a drive. And, they, and it's who we all thought, Jack Greasy. Ja yeah. But Jamari. Jamar Jordan, rather, in the backfield. It's a play fake, and it's picked off. Robinson, the true freshman, ties the game. Gushed about this kid and what he's been able to do. And he made the play of the night for this defense and has played well. And it's off play action. He doesn't see him. He's trying to hit the backside receiver coming across on the naked pass. The over route coming from the backside, and he just doesn't see Cam Robinson sitting right there in front of him, makes the interception and... Trying to punch a spot in the ACC championship game as the season winds down, and so does Plummer. Paul Akire with the sack. Pressure comes, designed run. Calandria the leading rusher. Calandria 
Austria with a cut. Jelani has to chase him down, and this true freshman is showing up. Back in the game at 14 all, it's second and 27. They're just gonna do a quick shot out of the backfield, see if they can't get some yards back. Ball is back out, yes. and scooped up! Malik Washington! Scoop and score! And score, but there is an injured player on the field. Here's a replay, and you hear coaches talk about the ball bouncing your way. Well, the ball, you know what? I always say this as a coach. You know what? The, who the ball bounces to? Guys that play really hard, and that's Washington that plays hard. Let's see this. Ooh. And that's Paris Jones, who's down on the field. He's the, he's the guy that fumbled it right there, that collision. We don't want it. Helmet right on helmet. <laughs> so first and 10 after the penalty, Plummer, play fake, rolls out to his right, keeps his eyes downfield. The pump fake got the defender to jump. We talked about what's at stake for Louisville. You're going to learn right here, right now, if they've got championship attitude down seven in the fourth quarter. Plummer to throw, quick shot out, first down. Good shot to Bell. That's 13. Yeah, and you watch that, the timing on the throw right there. Plummer making the throw right on time, right as he's about getting hit, right as you see his Bell's coming out of the break. Right now for Louisville, will be question. Third and 10. Time for Plummer. Over the middle of the field. It is tipped. And incomplete. But and Plummer he, falls incomplete. And you saw they ran a little high-low. Plummer, nice job. Saw so Brock travels dead on from 35. And it's good. 15 of 20, 225 on the night. They're going to play fake it with it. Plants his back foot, takes a shot wide open. Malik Washington, the ACC's leading receiver. Five consecutive games with 100 yards receiving for the transfer from Northwestern. And he just runs that out and up. Down. They're not going to sit back. They're going to come blitz him and make him get rid of the ball quickly. It's going to be pace in the backfield. Calandra's going to be pressured. You nailed it. They brought the pressure on the true freshman. Gelati has had a night. 38 yards. Right hatch. Betridge. Right down the middle. A chance to show it for Plummer. Sets up the screen to Garendo. Over the middle of the field, makes a man miss. There goes Garendo. A big night a week ago. Cohen King brings him down. 21. And that's the confidence you want to play in. And you look at it right now, Jack Plummer. A couple little mistakes, issues. Plummer rolls out. Wide open. Touchdown. Coach, this one was big. Plummer to Amari Huggins Bruce. Yeah, and if, like we said, if you want to be a championship team, you got to make championship plays, and they did on that drive. Third and ten. Calandria. Incomplete. Tipped. This defense all season, they needed them there and got the stop to the Cardinals. And see, they do slide the protection right there to Gillette. The center comes over to, to Gillette. That center comes over. Garendo. Chuck. Garendo. Gone. No flags. It's a well done stick. They're gonna run the counter play right here. We say championship teams, look at the great kick out, the block, and you just look defensively, the safety and the linebacker, Sanker and Jackson don't fit that the right way. Well, let's talk about you gotta fit it personally. See Sanker take it on with his right arm, he's gotta take it on with his left arm and spill it outside to Sanker to make the tackle. That they normally run, looks like Louisville's coming after him. Calandria. Hit as he throws, incomplete, nearly intercepted. 
one play away. Man-to-man -man coverage. Calandria throws incomplete. Virginia wanted action from Storm Duck on Malachi Fields with the comeback victory here in the fourth. There's a lot, a lot of contact right there and a little hands to the face at the beginning right there. Matt Austin, what did you see there? Give something. Try to take a red just so I can breathe.